So this is our shoulder extension, pails and reels. I know I've got to be a bit of a makeshift one going on here. Ideally, um, a physio table is perfect for this, but really it's just about making a device that allows you to place the arm in extension. Now, I want to sit out to the side, just so that I can go past the box without touching it. I want to see where my organic rotation goes to. In terms of pails and reels, we want to go our organic rotation and no more than, say, 15 degrees on past that. So I'm going to lean down a little bit just to get that up, and that'll be my 15 degrees. From here, we're in the stretch position, spine's tall, we don't want any compensations from here, we more importantly don't want the elbow to bend, nice and tall, we want to camp out in this position for two minutes. Big deep breaths, thinking about every bit of that stretch around that shoulder capsule melting every time you exhale. Our two minutes has passed, now it's on to our peels part. And remember, peels is always the opposite of what you're trying to achieve. So if we're trying to achieve sh shoulder extension here, peels will be flexing when we're trying to push the hand down through the bench. That's gonna help bypass the stretch re reflex by tricking the body. We push down, we push down. 10 seconds of building up the maximum tension, hold the maximum tension for another 10 seconds. Keeping the hand in a nice straight line with the shoulder, we've done our two minutes passive stretch. We've just done our first round of peels. Now it's time to reels. We're trying to lift the arm off without compensating here. That's where the body really wants to slide. Trying to lift off. If you can lift off here, you haven't started in a deep enough part of the stretch. The goal is to try and lift off, not actually to get off. If you do get off, start a little bit higher on the box or a little bit deeper in the squats or in that position you're sitting. After the first round of peels and reels, we're gonna take five deep breaths and repeat peels and reels one more time. After we've then expanded the range, it's time to work the range. So think about all your extension drills throughout the rest of the ebook, the prone extension lift-offs, the pack, the pull,